Okay, brothers and sisters, pump up the volume, pump up the jam. I thought I'm very conscious of the fact I've not been in touch with you for a while. Um, where are we at? We are... Well, these, these birds have only had like three races. But we've... Oh, we've still got a ton of late breads kicking away here. I bought in about 30. Anything with a yellow ring I bought in for Davy Hounslow or uh, Jim Emmon, aka Richard Scott, who did me these fantastic deals. That wee fucker there with his green clip is at the stock cube. So we've got a lot going on, but we haven't raced a lot. And I'm going to give that bit of credit to Mr. Emerton, who advised me, which in conjunction with Mr. Reynolds works really well, is. Mr. Emma advised me, um, less tosses, bigger jumps. And that's exactly what we've done this year. That's exactly what we've done. And then if you treat the basket as being stressful, I've got that coupled with a kuna matata. So now I'm fucking gibbering. Here's a brand new wiener way there. That should have been uh, Maisie's doddy. That wee brown thing behind it should have been Maisie's as well. Anyway, so, the gig is, we, Lim was postponed from last Saturday. Lim is on this Saturday. Given my build-up for last Saturday's Lim, I thought, fuck it, I'll hang on to them and private train them to go to Stafford. Now, I'm back on work on Thursday night. The weather's pish. And they've not been out of the shed for two weeks. So there's no way I'm just stuffing them into 165 miles. That's just not going to harm. That would make me feel very guilty. So the gig is, I'll do a couple of trainers. Probably Saturday night into Sunday morning. I'll take them down to Dolan and give them a chuck up. We only have, what we have, well, we have 16 good, five which are not good, and 10 that come back from the last race. So I'm looking to pick out the best six we have, send them to Dalton, hopefully Sunday morning, take them down to Gretna Monday, Tuesday morning, and we will pump them into Stafford at 165 next Friday night, which will be, I will also be in night shift, but I'll be getting up from night shift to go and basket them, so. I'm very, very, well at work you're not allowed to say, well, it's quiet, so <laughs> there must be words and pigeons where you're not allowed to use. It must be superstitious and jinx. So I'm definitely not. I'm definitely not confident. I'm just comfortable that this is probably the best platoon of YBs I've bred ever. <laughs> and we have a ton of late breads to play in the autumn with, and we've got a ton of wieners just coming out just now. AKA right on cue. Eh, <laughs> hey, that's a Hounslow. No, that's an Emerson. Hey, that's a Emerson. A wee tick eye bastard. He's a strawy wee cock already, I've noticed. Did you see them? The orange clips? Purple clips? That's the late bread team. That's the late bread. <laughs> that could be Hounslow, possibly. It doesn't look one of my Emerson's. But they're getting all molted now, eh? So I'll just let them molt and we'll fly them in November or something at minus six. <laughs> we'll do the van my way, Neil. The van my way, Neil. Here's another one coming in. <laughs> Fucking everywhere. Oh, yeah. That's just gone. But yeah, I'll stop rambling now. We're still in the race. We're not going this weekend. We will go to Stafford for the final Federation race, race which is an open. Don't know what the fuck that means. At 165. I've no idea what the dates and stuff is like, you know them, but uh, we'll go a week on Saturday. Oh, well done, Oscar. Oscar Bravo's landed. Oh, goodness. Plenty of babies in the sky, folks. Stick with us. Thanks for tuning in.